How's it going everybody? I'm recording this video because I found no other videos covering the topic, only videos that were close. So what I want to do is take this handle from the Goofy Vice Design and I want to print just this section of it in the new Cura feature fuzzy. So I'll have enhanced grip, but I only want it in this area not down in the gears here and to find how to only do it in this area was a little difficult so here's my video I'm recording my screen from my phone I couldn't figure out a screen recording software for this that I could easily sync audio with so here's the STL file I'm using my fast PLA profile which is 120 mmps print speed and a thousand acceleration works really well with PLA so you want to counterintuitively you're not gonna start with fuzzy skin here you're gonna slice normally <clears throat> hour and 42 minutes it's off screen you can't see it so the next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna choose support blocker here and I'm gonna add it to the base now I'm going to resize the blocker. Uh, I'm going to have to get bigger before I get smaller. Now I'm going to make it a little skinnier. I'm going to move that up and my goal is to only cover the flat portion of the screwdriver so I have too much here. I need to adjust that again. That looks like it might be closer. Okay, it looks good on top, but we still have too much hanging out on the bottom, so we're going to slice a little more. I'm not going to be super exact because I don't want the video to take too long. So now you can see we're only going to get grip or fuzzy skin in this area once the settings are correct. So move that over. All right, now that we've got that there, if we hit slice normally, we're not going to get the desired effect yet still going to show up as just normal texture. So what we're going to do is select only this block. Now I'm going to go back into per model settings and I'm going to modify settings for overlaps. Here I'm going to find fuzzy skin. I'm going to hit fuzzy skin and fuzzy skin outside only because I don't want the inside to have it. Now we're going to close that and the next thing I'm going to do here is I'm going to hit cutting mesh. If you leave it in film mesh it'll just slice again normally. So cutting mesh, now we should be able to re-slice. and I'm not changing any of the fuzzy defaults. Hour and 47 minutes didn't really change our time. And it didn't work yet, so we gotta try that again. Oh, here we go, fuzzy skin wasn't selected for some reason. Okay, slicing again. And this is why it's so important to check your preview because you won't waste any time if you check your preview. So now we can see we've got the fuzzy textured skin, which is exactly what I wanted. A little more grip on the handle, but only where the hand will engage. The top is still smooth, and the gears, oh, shift. The gears down at the bottom are still smooth, so they should all engage quite nicely still. Shouldn't have any problems with these gears meshing with these other red gears in the background there. Uh, all right, I hope that's helpful. It helped, uh, well, it would have been helpful if I found this video, so hopefully someone sees this and it makes it easier. I'm sure whiz kids know all about this, but I'm still very average. So, um, yeah, thanks for your time. Have a good one.